Uh, Prince George's County Deputy Sheriff, who's been with the department for nearly a decade, is facing a felony rape and assault charge. News 4 has learned the alleged victim is another law enforcement officer from another agency. Prince George's County Bureau Chief Tracy Wilkins spoke exclusively with the sheriff about the allegations made against one of his deputies. He is suspended currently right now without pay. Nine-year veteran Prince George's County Deputy Sheriff Corporal Brandon Burroughs is facing felony rape and assault charges in what police call a case of domestic violence. Prince George's County Sheriff John Carr. That they were allegations made and that it was uh, our responsibility as an agency and as this new elected sheriff and the sheriff of this county to actually address those issues right away and immediately. The Prince George's County Sheriff's Office announced the arrest yesterday. According to charging documents, a woman who has a child with Burroughs filed a complaint with the courts. She told police Burroughs attacked her in her home after a fight over child support in October. According to the criminal complaint, the woman tried filing restraining orders, including one the day after the alleged attack, but they were all dismissed. Sources who know the victim tell me she felt powerless because Burroughs works with the courts. News 4 has learned that the alleged victim is also a law enforcement officer for another agency. The sheriff's office serves peace orders and protective orders like the one the woman tried to have taken out. In fact, that was Deputy Burroughs' job with the agency. It required he have special domestic violence training. Our deputies are required to make sure that not only do they get the additional training, but that they go out and they model that behavior and what we want uh, to provide for our citizens here in the county. Carr says while he can't discuss details of the pending criminal case, he is being as transparent as possible for a reason. If we have any issues, whether it involves domestic violence, that we address them immediately because we can't expect the public to trust us and we can't expect our interactions with the public to be correct and right if we're not doing what we need to do. Deputy Burroughs' policing powers have been suspended pending the outcome of this case. And then there will be a second administrative investigation that will happen here at the sheriff's office. And up in Marlboro, I'm Tracy Wilkins, News 4. Now, Burroughs is out on $9,000 bond. Prince George's County Police brought the charges against him and is leading the investigation. We were unable to reach Burroughs' attorney for comment.